Grant Nichols Huntsville Doppler, and this, this is our town. Come on, walk with me. So it's been, what, two weeks, maybe three? I don't know, I'm losing track of time. Since cannabis, marijuana, weed, pot, Mary Jane, jazz, cabbage, whatever you want to call it, has been legalized for recreational use. Okay, I'm fine with that. I pass no judgment. So many people thought that this would be crazy, that things would change. It's, I mean, I don't think anything's really changed. I mean, those who have enjoyed the benefits of cannabis will continue to, and those who have not will continue not to. I mean, it's that simple. I do find it interesting, though, the availability through the government websites. I mean, once again, it proves to me that the private sector is much better at doing business than the government. If you don't believe me, go on the government site, then go on a private site. I've done it. It's, it's, it's crazy. There's so much difference. Like, for example, on a private site, way more is available. Prices are a lot better. They even have a thing called the Bud Club where you can put it towards your next purchase. Free shipping, free delivery, and it actually shows up on time. So I think the government's dropped the ball a little bit with that. And also, I've been reading the arguments of people saying that marijuana is a gateway drug. If you try the marijuana, the next thing you know, you'll have a needle stuck in your vein, or you'll be having your lips wrapped around a crack pipe or snorting whatever it is that people enjoy snorting these days. I don't buy that. I know many people that have enjoyed cannabis and they don't dabble at all in the hard drugs. And I can honestly say, and I'm being honest, I've never even tried cocaine or heroin or any other heavy drugs. I've smoked my share of marijuana. I'll admit that I have. So I don't buy the whole gateway argument. The one thing I find kind of weird as well is I could walk down the street, Main Street, Huntsville, in our town, and enjoy a marijuana cigarette. And nobody can really say anything to me. But I can't walk down the Main Street and have a king can, have a beer. I'm a criminal. It's, it's illegal. I, I could be fined or arrested. That part of it I don't really understand. But at the end of the day, like I said... I'm just happy, but I feel bad for for all those who spent time in prison, who had their reputations ripped apart, marriages destroyed, friendships destroyed, and lost their jobs over a small possession of marijuana. I wonder how some of those people are feeling now. Anyway, just me going on random as usual. Grant Nichols, Huntsville Doppler, and this, this is our town.